Hello everyone and welcome to Crafter Genius. This time it's a tutorial. Basically going to show you how to put a custom map into single player because I can't get any to come up at the moment and the mods and texture packs folder doesn't work. I've tried going into the finder, going into my hard drive, going into library, trying to find Minecraft, it's not there. Um, I also go into users, my name and uh, application supports not there either so basically all you want to do is follow my instructions which I put into the description it's taken from Yahoo Answers and this seems to do the trick for me basically what you want to do is copy and paste these quotes here without the quotes obviously tap into the spotlight at the top terminal and this is basically command command line basically copy and paste the same thing all you do is press enter doesn't look it's done anything. So all you do is click close, go into Apple, force quit, but make the finder relaunch. So this time what it's gonna do is um, relaunch the finder so hidden files will be able to view. So we'll see how that works. We'll go back into Finder and look, all of a sudden all these grey areas have come up. There's a home network, whatever it's called, over there. Um, so we'll go back into here go into library now um, go into application support wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. users <coughs> sorry about that users Andrew no well, yours not the Andrew um, library the hidden library this time so you go to hard drive users your name the hidden library uh, application support up the top and then find Minecraft in this folder you'll find uh, saves and all you do is basically copy and paste the folder not the zip file into here and you call it whatever you want to make it come up on your uh, game if you want to do texture packs you copy into the texture packs folder and then if you want to get rid of the um, hidden files what you do is copy and paste this bit here so the boolean up there made show all files was true now you're going to make it false so you go back into terminal copy and paste enter close force quit relaunch finder and well let's go back all the way back here now all of them are gone see so that's how you do it so See you later.